welcome to Audie for Care. Today's endangered animals are Aya. The Aya is one of the world's most unique, weird primates of species. The largest nocturnal primate and the only one to use echolocation to find food. What is echolocation? Echolocation is when an animal makes sound waves and listens to their echoes in order to judge distances. How does the Aya find food using echolocation? The eye is an omnivore that eats seeds, fruit, nectar, mushrooms, and insect larvae. It spends 80% of the night searching for food in the canopy. Between 5 to 41% of the eye's foraging time is spent on a behavior called personative foraging. This involves the eye tapping rapidly on the tree trunk or a branch with a bony middle finger. As it taps to listen to the resultant echoes, from these it's able to detect the hollow chambers created by wood boring grubs within the tree. When the eye successfully locates its prey, it chews a hole into the wood with a sharp teeth and slips its thin middle finger under the bark to draw the grub out. The versatile middle finger is also used to scoop out the fresh of coconuts and other fruits. Because of the eye's unusual mix of characteristics, a squirrel-like tail, a rodent-like teeth, a cat-like face features, as well as a highly adapted bony middle finger. Its classification is discussed for a long time. Now it's classified as a loomer. The eye is only found on the on Madagascar, an African island situated in the Indian Ocean off the east coast of the continent. The eye's fingers are long and have sharp pointed claws. The bony middle finger of the four paws is noticeably thinner than the others. Like a human shoulder, it has a ball and socket joint, giving it a wide range of movement. It was previously thought to be instinct but it was rediscovered at 1961. Although the actual population of size is, of the species is unknown, it's estimated that the population has declined more than 50% of the last three generations, and it's likely to continue to decline. The eye remains an endangered species, not only because its habitat is being destroyed, but also due to the native superstition. Asian Magassi legend said that the eye has a symbol of death, with some believing its mere appearance predicts the death of a villager. Even currently, many Malagasy people think it's a bad omen to see an eye, as it has led to the species being desperately hunted. Oh, no way! Don't judge a book by its cover! Thank you for watching my video. The more you share, the more people will care. Thank you for watching my video. I'd like to end this video with my favorite quote from Aunt Judy Hepper. You have two hands. One for helping yourself, the other for helping others. Bye bye. Bye bye all.